Uh, Lucky Series 7, welcome to Band World. If you're never gonna donate, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> keeps ticking like a metronome and my thoughts keep telling me to get me home But my balls keep telling me to let me out Oh, just let me out That cock keeps ticking like a metronome And my thoughts keep telling me to get me home But my balls keep telling me to let me out Oh, just let me out That cock keeps ticking like a metronome And my thoughts keep telling me to get me home But my balls keep telling me to let me out Ah. Broadcasting you live from the heart of Europe, this is the most bad age you do broadcast from the off no land, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Tommy C, and this is Shot for the Point. Point man today is Nick and Jeff. What's up? I don't know, you, you talk you talk me into this shit. I really I don't want to do this. There's I can't believe I can't believe we're actually <laughs> Yeah, like 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 it's it's like the whole kick them when they're down movement. I mean, um Yeah, I I, I just I I, I, I but, I gotta be honest. I think I have something to say. It is he is in a fast he is in a fascinating, unique, and maybe first of his kind position. He got famous. He, he got the dream. He got famous playing games, playing video games for a living. And when I was a kid in the eighties, not only was there's no example, there's no other guy that was doing it except Todd Rogers, and nobody knew it because he and it turned out he was a big cheat. Um, it, it, it he he got the dream. And now, in some weird, twisted uh, situation, like a twist of fate, he has to play. He has to like, get up, you fat fuck. Fucking play. Play that shit. Come on. Do it. Do it. Can you imagine that shit? I can honestly walk away from this. False, it, motiva false motivation. Well, false he, motivation. He, now, false motivation. This motherfucker will tell you he hates the shit, and he hates you, and you better donate or get the fuck out. <laughs> You could have your channel Rob. die like Wings of Redemption or live long enough to see yourself become Banks. <laughs> <laughs> so it's, it is, I mean, I, I heard videos of him. I, I'm going through this. I watch videos of him. If, thanks so much, Scrubby. Wings of Redemption loves to eat wings, ironically. That, i not shocked. <laughs> I, I literally saw a picture of him, which I'm afraid to put up here, of him holding his stomach. I, I, I think we get instantly, this, like he had it in his, he had like a headlock on it. Boogie exactly. three nine eight eight. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to hell. Oh yeah, in oh, a handbasket. He's, he's this southern incest off-brand boogie. All right, here's my new rule, though. I got to be honest with you. This, this is my new rule with these fucking guys. If you're a fucking retard, most of the time I won't take a swing at you. It's as if, it, it, and, and I've I've kept this this rule for, for such a long time, and I've learned with the so I guess the Keemstar incident that I'm no longer going to do that. And here's here's the rule. Doesn't mean I'm going to do it every time. It's if you can swing back. And this guy swings back in his own subs in a lot of, a lot of situations. <laughs> Admittedly, some of these subs are fucking with him. But Ban everyone who tries to help me in the chat. <laughs> yeah, fuck, every, fuck yeah. everybody trying to help me. That's probably you, not the best way to build a positive relationship with your Je fans so they stay loyal to you. Jeff, did you grow up with Wings? Did you know who he was from the whole... Were you, were you familiar with Because I know yeah, you were yeah, like, yeah, like I watched him back in the... Uh, God, when did he, he so he brought what when did he break that controller back in like 2010 2011 yeah something like that oh, yeah. was, that guy spends he, more money on controllers than he gets paid. Uh, uh, he, yeah he, I know. he was big he was big in the mw2 days and i was just i that's actually right when i got into youtube was yeah. uh modern warfare 2 and it, he was one of the first guys i i started watching it's so bizarre like he got it he had it all and now it's like it's like a Twilight Zone episode. Like at the end, now he has to do it. It's it's so weird, and that's what I find. If he doesn't make uh, sixty dollars a stream, he doesn't have enough money to buy a controller for the next. Stream. <laughs> yeah, I was just thinking of that. It's not like he's, he's got the his... um, he's got the iDubs N word complex for e bagging. He can e bag all he wants, and it's not worse than half the shit that he says on his stream. So no one gives him shit for it. Nah, it's just oh yeah, oh he can say the N word. Well, e bagging might be okay if you if. You do it in a positive way. No, I mean, yeah. nobody cares. If you e nobody cares. People just give money because it's funny. <laughs> People just give money. He constantly it's funny. does things that are worse than e-bagging. That's why they don't care. <laughs> yeah, no. ah, let's do this. Fuck it. Come on. Yeah. There he is. I still don't think I still don't think you're using that right. But fuck, fuck it. I can use it any way I want. That's the idea. <laughs> I paid for it. I can use it any way I want. Like, did 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 Vegas say how I should be using it? No, he didn't. He, he probably did. <laughs> no, he didn't. He just sends me this shit. I've used all sorts of stuff that he changed me in unintended ways. L look at Get to the Point. That looked nice when it came out. <laughs> yeah, the, that, that went well. 
It went. It looked good. Looks better near videos. Fucking uh, chuckles. What are you trying to do? I stole the do? outro a couple what's times. What's with your hillbilly haircut? Why? Why is what? why is your hair so long? Like, what's with this hillbilly haircut? That, that's what. Okay, so how does that's that make the that flow, happen? Tommy? Okay, yeah, that, yeah, <laughs> yeah. If you don't get your hair cut in, it's August now. So if you don't get your hair cut in ten months, it will be longer than what it was. Well, 10 yeah, months I ago. understand why it's longer. That's not. I'm not, not in fucking science clan here. I'm, I'm trying to cosplay you... as Thor on Halloween. Yeah, yeah, God. Yes, that's that's it. You look ridiculous. You look like a big hillbilly. By the way, we have the we brand there, new. Uh... We joke about you being a hillbilly, and then he's like, "Oh, well, I'll just, I'll just own it." You know, you're, you're kind of like fucking Wings of the Redemption. You know, like, I'm a big fat you know, fucking come, come loser. Octo fuck. come, octo come October, give me a fucking hammer and give me a red Let cape. Fuck you, man! Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's watch Wings of the Redemption. He has a lot of interesting things to say. It's just about everyone you shouldn't say as a streamer, which kind of makes him funny. Here's what we're going to do. Alright? We're going to get myself banned from live stream fails. Because that way, nobody will make <laughs> <What>? fun of me. <laughs> Here's what we're going to do. Yeah. All right. We're going to get myself banned from live stream fails. I want everybody in the chat to clip this stream. Mm. Right. And then everybody go over to live stream fails and post it. I want like 15 posts on live stream fails to get me banned from there. So nobody will make fun it's of me. Funny he says, he says 15, everybody and then he says 15. 15. He can't hold a fucking audience. Yeah. <laughs> well, I heard he holds like 100 and 200. Holding 100 and Twitch oh, he, is a lot harder than holding 100 on YouTube. Yeah. He holds a lot more when he plays Call of Duty than when he plays Rainbow Six. Is that true? When he plays Call of Duty, he also cries. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> the, the, there's actually, I don't, I don't know if you saw there. Jay and Silent Bob are co-hosts today. <laughs> <laughs> what are you saying, Jeff? I was saying that there's a clip out there. I think it was, was from like November of 2016 or something mm -hmm. like that where Wings is playing Battlefield 1 and he... Yep. Crying, saying that Call of Duty ruined his his life. He goes, man, I had seven hundred people in here yesterday. <laughs> he's Call not, he's not wrong. <laughs> he's not wrong. Call of Duty kind of ruined his life. Video games ruined his life. You know, fucking Anita Sarkeesian and Jack Thompson never warned us about turning into fucking Wings of Redemption. <laughs> they, <laughs> they just said we were gonna kill people if we played Grand Theft Auto. Welcome to fuck it. All right, let's check this check this out. But I, I like the idea, like. If live streams fails wasn't there to goof on him, if he gets banned from there, because they'll ban anybody for anything. That's why they're getting their ass kicked by a uh, um, Ice Poseidon's rival Reddit site. Um, therefore, his life would be fine. At this point, I think I'd have to say there, Jordy, this is the only reason you're getting any money. Living meme. I mean, am, I, I'm not even being insulting here. Am I wrong? Zivago, no, am I wrong? No. no. Exactly. If no. he made like self-aware, ironic YouTube videos, he could bring himself back. You think so? <laughs> oh, oh, hundred yeah. percent. You think really? Hundred percent. Is he that good? If he made like the. Is he good in the sticks? No. He played into the meme. Of if himself, he played into the meme, really though, he bit into it. People would pay to watch it. He can't do it. He doesn't have the talent. Look at Ice Poseidon. By the way, we got a brand new Gay Tobe shirt in the store, and if uh, you don't want it, you can get the fuck out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Exactly. All right. Let's watch this. I want to get off of this. I had to. I, I could have beat both of them. Like I already had Blackbeard hurt. Was it Pro Syndicate? I got killed through Pico. What game is that? Rainbow Six. I never played it. Yeah, Do I have that? Got. Yeah, this game's very complicated. It's, it's the actually... game that like crashes your computer every time you try to stream it. Oh yeah, oh that one? Yeah, no one. <laughs> <laughs> fucking shit. It's fucking good! <laughs> I wanna see that Grandma, again. Grandma, I need another I controller! <laughs> fucking shit. Here's what I don't get. Alright, he finishes his controller all the time, right? He says he doesn't give a shit. He, why, why does he care if he plays good? Does he get make more money when he plays good? Well, he's, I mean, I'm over competitive too. Yeah, it's just... Well, he hates the game, but he says he hates this game. He hates all these games. That's why he gets more mad. <laughs> it's funny. He hates yeah. it. He has to play it. He can't do the, 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 the little he satisfaction he gets is by performing well. Jesus oh, God. He must have had to stream for 24 hours to get that $100, too. Oh, really? He doesn't get much donations. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> 
I'm gonna say it's hack. Like video the... games are supposed to be fun. They're like my favorite hobby. And watching him. Why doesn't he make the fucking camera a better angle? It's like his little fucking head in the bottom left hand corner of the entire fucking webcam thing. Cause fuck it's you, donate. Cause <laughs> fuck you, donate. That's why. <laughs> Wait a minute, Kim, what's your $70,000? I'll yeah. buy a fucking green screen, you, you, you fucking yank. We're not leaving the main menu until I have 24 fucking dollars in my PayPal. Oh shit, this ain't some shit. You thought buying DLC was bad. <laughs> I don't know why people want to feel the need that to come in here and try to make my life worse. I'm a 450 pound dude that can barely walk. My life can't get much worse. Go, 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 go. I don't yeah, know that he's wrong. You're let, yeah, you're let, he's let, you're letting him do it right now though. Yeah, yeah, yeah that, that, guys like that, they don't stop. Go bother somebody like fucking yeah, Syndicate who steals money from children <laughs> and 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 drives Lamborghinis and shit and bees a total fucking douchebag his entire life. Yeah, that was the turning point, wasn't it? He beat him in one fucking game yeah, on it's... Bug. And five years <laughs> later, he's still not over it. <laughs> it was actually uh, seven, I think, but... Seven yeah. He should have made a commentary video on him in 2016 when he got in trouble. <laughs> And well, that was that. That whole thing was his. God. I wasn't in the Call of Duty. That was him running his fucking mouth, correct? Against zombie players, correct? Yeah, the zombie players aren't real players. They can't beat us. Oh yeah, I bet I could fucking fuck you up, Mister Syndicate. Really? Bash his controller, man. Why the fuck do you record that? What do you think? Uh, <laughs> they broadcast it live. Like, didn't they? Um, I thought it'd be a good idea. Like, why the fuck you stream that? Wings, stop making fun of me. Thanks. <laughs> I actually. I want a string wing. I I, I want I want I'm gonna ask. I'm probably gonna get him because my association with Keemstar. But I want I want I really want to interview Wings for real. These two jackasses will not be here. I promise. <laughs> I want I want Thanks. I want um I want to in interview Wings one on one, and I'm not gonna make fun of him. And I think I could still make it entertaining. I want to give him a scarce type interview. I want to go from the beginning, the middle, out, and yeah. the end. And yes, Jordy, I'm willing to pay you. So, oh I'll God. take a loss. I do. I really want to talk to Jordy. First, I'm going to fuck with you. Hold on. <laughs> ah! Jesus Christ, his oh chest almost fucking flew up and knocked him out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you guys feel that over in China? That's the earthquake. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Is that a waterbed? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Wow. Three, God. two, one. Oh. Hold on. What was that? I don't fucking know, man. Like, this is the reason. This is the reason I have trouble making YouTube videos because people come in here. And they just kick me. All they fucking do is kick me over and over and over again. That's what we're doing now, Wick. <laughs> Man, he made the donation go. We're forty three dollars. Like all this trolling hasn't even got us to fifty dollars yet. I, I just get. I, that's my life. My life is just waking up, being fucking fat, and getting kicked. That's all it is. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck you terrible. Tell a kid that what the fuck's the matter with you, Diorio? And they start crying. <laughs> the fuck is the matter with you, That's man? Be bad and get kicked. <laughs> Mom said I can't play the game anymore, so I guess I'm just gonna have to go and do whatever I want. He's bitter. I gotta go outside for once. <laughs> Does he have a right to be bitter, Jeff? Does he have a right to be bitter? Yeah. I don't know. I, I mean, like, just, when I watch- He's like he's constantly, constantly depressed. I mean, well, wouldn't you be depressed in this it. situation? This guy. I mean, sick, I guess. Man. I guess so. I mean, but fuck, like he just. But you know, the, you know, I saw he, Woody. He, like he, he, he lets the stuff get to him. I saw the Woody's ga like, gamer tag. At this point, that's who he is. He's got to embrace it, like the Oreo said. I saw Woody's gamer tag. They did try to help him. They did try to get him to lose weight. He can't. He is just. There is absolutely no self discipline. He got the there. surgery. No, he's yeah. getting it. Did he get? The no, surgery? he already got, got it. it. He went to Mexico and all that, and got the surgery. Mexico. Yep. This motherfucker said he was scared happens, to get in the security and he, and he went sanitary. to Mexico to get it. Why couldn't he get it in the States? Oh, it's cheaper in Mexico. Apparently, you know, Mexico's a lot cheaper. <laughs> God, would you he do that? Come back maybe with the sight of MRSA. Be, yeah, I would have let Kim no, do it. Let me, let me level with you real quick. What? 
What are the odds you get to be a YouTuber as big as Syndicate? <laughs> uh, less than one. It's it, you know what? Now, like, what are the you know, I was told it's one percent to, to even get where I am. That's that's how rare. Yeah, that it is. was yeah. my next question. So now, they, like, what do you think like, it is to get to what Wings Redemption is? About one percent. So he's lucky. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I know. This is what you get when you're lucky. He, yeah, it's true. It's true. Wait, we're like, in a time in there in our lives right now where people are paying for Fortnite coaches yeah. for their children. Oh god. So I would never do they that. They are that's a big thing. I saw it on Philip DeFranco, so it has to be real. Um DeFranco a fan funny. Yeah, right. God. No, but like that's what you're signing up for. And you're getting on a game like Fortnite, you're getting on a game like Call of Duty. They have lifespans and when when they end, you're either switching to something, losing your brand, or becoming Ali A. It's really no <laughs> It's really, really is funny to Hey, jerk off. I'm told I was told that anybody that's making money post fuck is like one percent. Making money. Like reasonable money, like professional money. And I'm in that one percentile. Like if you, if you think about it, there's probably only about fucking thousand people that are making serious money that aren't a corporation. Oh shit! Speaking oh, of, oh shit! Uh, <laughs> Fifty bucks, Damn. face it. Thank you. Well, that's another thing too. Like, I mean, I'm not saying I've ever gotten goofed on on the level that Wings has. I haven't. But I have yeah, had some pretty you don't, you, don't, you don't let it get. You don't let it drag you down. Day well, after the day. only time I didn't like something is probably. Well, I'm not going to say that actually. But I've had shit with my family happen, right? But I just I don't go on a bitch about it. Like, uh, the, the worst thing you could do, I saw eight thoughts he was getting into with uh, uh, some guy. Somebody sent me a video before, like, last month. And he's like, you know, the guy's doing the same typical shit that we hear. You're only doing this for views. You're only doing this. There's bigger users. You're taking advantage. You're taking their content and stuff like that. And, like, I don't think I've ever done that. You know? 50 bucks a Bex. My Bex days are over. I'm going to the doctor again tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, he's actually going to be following my diet after a, a little three so months, four, the, four the, months ago. So far, so far, the diet has been implemented to the point where my wife is doing it for me. So the three meals I get thus far, then it's now the rest is me. More. I can't order pizza during the day. <laughs> that was my favorite fucking tweet. Uh, Tommy's going to be on a brand new yeah, diet. No, I, oh, I, by I, the way, I had pizza and coke <laughs> today. Yeah, and that, yeah, that's why I posted that tweet after your stream. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. All right. My wife just gave me a dirty look. I don't know. Did they say something about her? So let's go watch hey, it. Hey! Let's get some context. Uh, being that. fucking fat and getting kicked. Yeah. That's all it is. Like, I fucking. Hey! I was, I was playing Call of Duty, Call of Duty earlier, and I, I got upset. I just turned the game off and just kind of walked away. Um, no, it would have to be 1%. Stop, stop making fun of me in the chat. Think about it. How many fucking YouTube uh, uh, channels are there? Bazillions? Multi? M hundreds of millions? Bazillions. That's not even a number and I invented it. I'm not saying it's just to fucking flow my old ego. I'm just saying it because it's probably a fact. Anybody that's making more than fucking two, three grand a month is in the 1%. Yeah, especially now in the world. Yeah, and even now. Yellow if you circle. take all the yeah, YouTube it. channels, it's probably a fact. I mean, somebody told me this shit. I'm not saying I'm a big shot. I'm not, I hate everything or anything like that. But it's just like, how hard is it? Hey, hey, dubious. If it's so fucking e easy, why? Hey, you got a little hockey player in your. Why don't you start a channel? Why don't you do what I did? Make no money for fucking four years straight. If it's so fucking and that's easy. Our moms. Jerk off. Now I sound like Wings of Redemption. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're you're letting it get to you. Yeah. Break your microphone. Break your microphone. Break my break my <laughs> vape. <laughs> yeah, actually it's break. Really actually like break. It. No, I can't break tell no fucking stories. <laughs> All right, one of the guys in the chat, this is funny, ask him to tell a story. No, I can't tell no fucking stories, man. I don't, I don't have any stories. I sit in the house all day. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I know. Jeez. Yeah, some of you guys grew up liking him. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, my God. It's about the gameplay. And, and you know what? The bank <laughs> was cringy. Yeah, you're right. Stay. <laughs> You got the power to fix it, man. No, he doesn't. Somebody get this man. What, if we, what the fuck you want me to do, man? I had two teammates. I had one who was 0 and 15, another was 2 and 16. How the fuck I'm not blaming teammates? Fuck you, Wager King. Get the fuck out of my chat. Get somebody ban him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I feel bad for that, too. But I'm going to do it anyway. Yeah, a little World War II action. There you go. Good shot. Dude, All right, hold. Oh. Kappa five. 
Why? Why? Because he called it airstrike. <laughs> that airstrike landed in your general vicinity. Yeah. I, Anyways, happy Thanksgiving. I don't celebrate Thanksgiving. <clears throat> and from my understanding, you're not even American. So, like, you don't celebrate Thanksgiving either. So, like, why would you even say that? Thank you for the donations, though. <laughs> Thanks for your money. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> Oh man! What are you, one of them limeys over there in England? Ah, oh, yeah, it's happy. <laughs> what an asshole! See, it's like it's stuff like this is why he gets swung on, you know. I think some people are beyond help, and I think it's him. Yeah, I mean, if you want something fixed, if your go mind on, is, go on, fix if it. your mind has been destroyed and you're not willing to do anything about it, oh, if the mind's gone. If the, the, mind's if the gone. mindset's the gone, mind's then there's gone. no. It probably is never there to begin with. He became lucky as fuck and thought it was going to be there together. I don't know how many of these guys that it, it's going to keep happening too because like when you put all um, the eggs, eggs in that one basket. When you make yeah, they get, because they think I made it. I'm gonna well, it depends on what level <laughs> you made it at. To suck. And it depends on what you spend. Let's say you're a YouTuber and you get a, and you make a million dollars, one million dollars, and you live a five hundred thousand dollar a year lifestyle. Well, guess what? It's over in a year and a half. You know, <laughs> you know. It's a, you know what the real kicker is? Yeah. It's a real shame that the gene pool is going to end here. Those are so many great genetic traits in Wings of Redemption. Hey, you never know. That surgery can work else. out. Watch the... Uh, <laughs> well, I, I did watch the Madiger thing. Um, and it was good as far as entertainment. But it's just like... I don't know. I, I'm trying desperately to do something different. But I guess there's nowhere to go but beat up on him. I, I do want to interview him. I think I could get something out of him. Let's talk about the, after this. He went to Mexico for that surgery. The first question I ask, you, say, you fucking uh, Like I was saying, that does not seem sanitary. Oh, no, no, God, no. It's sanitary. It's not even that. It's just like, I, I'm sorry. The doctors probably aren't as good down there in general. It's cheaper for a reason. You know, it's like anything. <laughs> you know, it's like, it's like you, 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 you spend less money in a car than you would if, I'd say, the amount of money it would cost to buy a fucking Lamborghini. That the car that you spent less on is not going to be as good as me. I mean, come on. Let's Only just... fucking degenerates drive Lamborghinis, like people who That's beat right. me in Call of Duty. <laughs> you know, Lamborghinis were really big in the '80s. Like that was that was the car to have, and then they went out of style '90s, 2000s, and now they're back again. Like that's that that is the ultimate in flexing now is a, is a Lambo. Huh. Great down toss. That's that's the that's known as the twelve to six toss. Uh, and that hurt to get up. <laughs> they should uh, have Call of Duty implement hit markers that when he throws his controller on the ground, ah! go off. I put so Actually, many hours into Rainbow Six, and all I've done is lose viewers. I lost five subscribers while playing Rainbow Six. Five. I had a. I was struggling to keep 150 views. I'm almost at 300 on a game I fucking hate. It's a game I fucking hate, dude. I detest this game. This game makes me hate fucking life. It really does. And motherfuckers that come in here just to watch this shit, I hate you too. I literally do. Yeah, right. I wish you just wouldn't show up so I didn't have to play this shit. So, like, it would just fail like Rainbow Six. At least then I would have to look for an answer somewhere else. Has he tried Doki Doki Literature Club? No, have you tried Doki Doki Literature Club, sir? Has he tried Super Seducer? <laughs> <laughs> that is an idea. Oh my idea. god! He's, if he plays Super Seducer, simulator. I will put a video on this channel, oh. right? I He says, get you know, delusional asshole, get a job. How? Wh what are you going to tell? What are you putting in your resume? I, I got my ass kicked by Syndicate in 2010. When I stand up, it hurts. That's my resume. <laughs> that, that's the thing. I mean, he, it's such a trap. I mean, I want you to think about this. He's, what he's making now is probably more than a fucking regular job, right? So you can't quit to take less money just to have the dig, you know, save your dignity to delusional ass. That's clearly. You know? Clearly, he's getting no fulfillment in it. No, it's look. Just this is the guy that got swatted a fucking assault rifle to his face, freaking the fuck out, and he just turned around, walked back down, put on his headphones, and goes, "All right, we got to start streaming again." Yeah, because he had to start streaming again. They sent a suicide machine to his house. <laughs> <laughs> they 
Yeah, he sure did. He didn't even flinch. <laughs> So it's easy to say, get a job. All right, what's he going to do? He didn't go to college. He was too busy making shit happen online. I was like, does anybody have any old streams of him? Like, from back in 2010? Hey, guys, how you doing? It's going to play some Call of Duty. New game out today. It's called Call of Duty Black Ops 2. Let's check it out. What do you say? Is that what he like back I think he was always a douche. I, <laughs> he, I, I don't, he, no, he, he's always kind of very, like, He used to do cut comps. Yeah. But there's, there's just like no, no pep in a step whatsoever. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. He's like, get a job. But he's, you don't understand, delusional asshole. If it's less money, you can't take it. You know? I think he did a podcast back in the day with Woody and everybody. Painkiller pain, yeah. pain already. But they don't yeah, talk to him anymore yeah. either. They have nothing to do with him, right? Well, Wings wouldn't come I, I back. I can't imagine like, why. <laughs> Wings was associating with somebody that tried to get Woody's kids taken away from him. Yeah, what was that about? Press like, Wings like, about it. Was it was that? it was because somebody in Woody's or in Wings's chat was donating to him, mm -hmm. and Wings was being buddy buddy with him because he was donating. Yeah. But that's also the same guy that was trying to dox uh, Woody. Ah, uh, yeah, that did, would, did Wings that know would that? probably upset me too. Did Wings know that? Wings knew. He, could you imagine? Oh uh, yeah, I'm gonna send your donation back. <laughs> no. He said, "Oh wait, you doxed, <laughs> no. you doxed my buddy." He's not as good as Tommy. There, if you go and say something, Tommy will send the donation back. Wings is like, "Oh, you're doxing my friend. Keep the fifties coming." Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> it was doc. Oh, yeah, that was in the Medicare video, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I guess they and he they they tried to help. How the fuck? You died. That yeah, was yeah. actually I'll, a grenade. I'll, put, I'll, you I'll play. It. You know, ran, random grenades are a bitch. I get it. Yeah. Uh, Lucky Series Seven. Welcome to Ban World. If you're never gonna donate, <laughs> get the fuck out of here. <laughs> get the fuck out. Welcome to Ban World. What? What is it? <laughs> it's, like, it's like Walmart, but it's where he puts all of his subs. Ban World. Like, hey, welcome to Ninjas. Not gonna donate. Get the fuck out. I'd pay fucking Ninja ten grand to say that. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Ten grand, that's a good day for him. Oh! Yo, he's fucking good at that. He yeah, had yeah. that mapped out to his hand. Yeah, he no, no, fucking... yeah, yeah. <laughs> play that long. Oh I mean, he must be better than us. Better at rage quitting. Fuck yeah, he is. <laughs> Hundred four dollars fifty seven. You keep doing that too. You check out which money he makes. I keep looking at them. Which money he made? <laughs> oh my god. Only reason I stream Call of Duty is when I when I'm at the point where I need the when I need subscribers. Don't, I don't play this game for fun. I don't give a fuck about Call of Duty. You say another <laughs> word like that, you get banned from this channel, please. Uh, keep in mind, I do not joke around. I do not. I do not giggle. I do not try to have fun. I do not try to laugh. High quality. So please say stuff, something constructive and don't, don't try to joke around with me. I, I want to point out that he only has ten dollars at this point in the stream. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> I made more than that last week every fucking day I stream. We don't know how long he's been on, but in fairness, like, like this is not this is not a good business model. You know what I mean? Probably not. I mean, listen, listen. Not. I've only been doing this pro two years. All right, this is not a good business model. I, I'm, I, I know Wings. You've been doing this. No, this, than this me. is not building a positive this fun not, relationship with not. anybody who watches. Say, I love that. I do not joke around. I do not have fun. I do not joke around. This is basically the Soviet Union in the mid seventies. You, you need to donate. You need to get lost. It's, it's like it's like you're going into an old man bar. Are you gonna buy a drink, or you because you need to fucking get the fuck out of here if you're not. That's what it feels like, right? Like some bar you just walked in that they don't want you there, but they can't kick you out unless you refuse to buy a drink. I'll get a drink. You don't have to. You can just get the fuck out. Have fun. I do not try to laugh. So please say stuff something constructive you, and don't don't. Try. What, what 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 could you possibly say constructive in a fucking Twitch stream? Good Quit. shot. That's not constructive. <laughs> and and Quit. something That's tells me if they, if, if, if they critique say. your strategy and think if you have to do this and that, you're not going to take the advice. You're just going to yell at them. Probably ban them from the chat. You know what we should do? We need to get shot from the point mods and his like we have to gain his trust and get mods in there. <laughs> <laughs> that is when you tell somebody, probably. You know, I'm just gonna go out on a safe, sturdy limb and saying that's not gonna work. All I gotta say is I don't have the money to do that. Oh, 
you have to pay. You got to put. You probably got to throw that guy like three hundred dollars at least to be his mod. Yeah. So I'm so glad that I've never done. I never thought to do. I couldn't do that because I heard Keemstar used to do that. You had to be fifty bucks to be his mod. People would actually pay for that shit. Are you kidding me? I mean, people pay for Ice Poseidon mod. So. I was, was going to say, people pay for fake followers on Twitter. Yeah, people pay to talk to me, but it's like fucking, it's only a buck. You know, I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I could charge, even if I could charge more, which I probably could, be honest with you. I, I don't feel comfortable. Try to joke around with me. Don't joke around. No fun. To be fair, this map fucking sucks. I wanted to hang myself every time Shut I played the it. The game went out. Hold on. The fucking stream went out. That that is sad. There's just nothing sad. <laughs> Did he have a super seducer shirt on? What the fuck kind of shirt he had? I don't check that out. Was that super seducer? You, you know what, Nick? No, it wasn't. You know serious. the hit the hit markers in Black Ops Four actually do sound like that. They're yeah. pretty loud. <laughs> Fucking awful. This is so sad. This chair sounds worse than mine. Dude, I've had fucking three bad days in a row. When he says bad day, he means like money. It's 136 bucks he's got up there. That's all week, no. <laughs> That's all month. That's all month. Oh my god. He's laying back like fuck it. Oh, he's got a blue Yeti. I know. I really hate him. Ugh. <laughs> Thanks. Yes, I hate that fucking. Every thing. single fucking co-host has a blue Yeti. Fucking. This is fucking it's it's it. <laughs> yeah, why don't you fucking buy a stand for it? Put it next to your math, hillbilly. Don't fucking tease me. <laughs> Speaking of hillbillies, look at this guy. Oh, dude, I'm, I'm deleting you. No, dude. Oh, no, you. No, I'm out. Keep going, dude. You Fuck that nigga. <laughs> oh, my lord. I hate you can say the N word. He's so fucked, he's getting there. No, black guys wouldn't even move. Oh, you can say what you like. You're fucked. Oh, my God. I hate him. I hate him. What the fuck? That's Fuck it. Video game is supposed you to be fun. You should try OBS. <laughs> Notice, please. Can, what does it say? Player disconnect. Yeah, probably can't. The, the oh shit! Oh my god, oh, he fell down. It doesn't get any worse. <laughs> no, check. All right, so I posted. The, what? I posted it in the shop of the point newsroom. It's the darkest thing ever seen on Wings of Redemption's live stream, as narrated by FPS Kyle, which was FPS Russia. Yeah. And it's like a minute long, and it's Wings eating this banquet dinner. All right, I'll get to that in a minute. <laughs> Let me finish this crap first. I'll watch that. I, I want to watch him fall again. Oh, look at, look at this shit. He fucking falls. It's like when I think he, I, I, hey, I think you guys got to stop interrupting. Yeah, you guys got to stop interrupting the big moments here. Oh, both of you. As soon as I get home, the first thing I'm gonna do is punch your mama in the mouth. That's his fucking. <laughs> hey, can somebody get that for me? I want to use that on my donation thing. Holy Christmas! Oh, <laughs> that looks like one of my games. Oh, I'm still getting. Oh. <laughs> That would probably make me fling a control. He's, like, he's like laying on his back. Look at him. He looks like a blanket. Oh my god. That's, that's sad. They're gonna have to make the scuff defender just for him. They can take three wall throws. You never answered my question, <laughs> can you see your dick? No, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, not a first person shooter. What the fuck is this? Imagine, get, imagine waking up every day of your life. Barely able to walk, and all you do is get picked on and criticized. That's my life. I thought he wanted constructive criticism. Just, he's just got a substance, wings of anemia. <laughs> on there, <actually. laughs> Oh, I know this video! Yeah, here, here you go. Hey, look at that subscriber right there. I was here looking up stuff about the surgery and about anemia. Guess what? He makes an account, makes a makes a Twitch Prime account. There you go. 
Now when I ban him, people are going to criticize me for banning subs. That's all that's going to be. I don't give a fuck, man. Like, I hate my fucking life at this point. I, bet. I really do. People are fucking assholes. You trolls just news. sit there and drill me all day. All day. Nobody wants to help me. Apparently that's not true. It's ridiculous. It ain't about getting a motherfucking surgery, dude. There's a lot more things to it. Not to mention, I'm scared to fucking death of the surgery. Except in Mexico, apparently. <laughs> I'm I to go to Mexico. Hey, I take care of your surgery, man. Don't worry about it. I got you. I know how to cut real good. <laughs> oh, God. God. Scared of it. Scared Who do I get to talk to about it? Nobody. Because if I talk about anything, on air everything, there's a video made about it, and there's 20,000 people laughing at me, or there's a podcast with 100,000 <laughs> viewers making fun of me, calling me a fucking idiot. What, what What is there? It's like, seriously, what is there? Wings of Redemption, everybody. Now, what do you got? Oh, uh, it's in the newsroom chat. Let me it's see the last shit. thing posted. It's, it's a thing chat. from the PK8, or whatever their podcast was, yeah. with Woody and... Um, I want to talk to this man. I want to help him. You know why I want to help him? First of all... Jordan Peterson's 12 Rules for Life. Um, the first one is make your bed. I think that'll help. And the last one is, is pet a cat. I honestly think, honestly, I think this would help why you. you. Why would you pet a cat? You can read the book, stupid. I don't you think dumb hillbilly. This is the book for you, sir. Make your bed. I think rule three is wash your penis. <laughs> I saw some meme in there. George Jordan Peterson. <laughs> this is, this is like a book of some watch it. Yeah, yeah. Thanks so much. Wings is into fitness. Fitting them cheeseburgers in his mouth. <laughs> and Thank you, you would have been fight. banned on his uh, yeah, on the stream. You're banned. Nope. What if I've been blocked? All right. Or this is. What is this in the chat? I gotta see this fucking horse yeah, shit. Shot the newsroom chat. Oh, I hate that already. I'm gonna get rid of it. Um. The darkest thing I've ever seen in Wings of Redemption stream. And this is narrated by FPS Russia out of character. Really? Yeah. That guy shouldn't be goofing on anybody. Woody and all them. That guy shouldn't be goofing on anybody. FPS Russia. I have a picture of me in the 200s, actually. I'm gonna grab it. I was Weren't they friends, too? Weren't they yeah, friends, they, too? They were all on the podcast together with Woody. Yeah. Yeah. God, they did it for how long? It still goes on. Well, is that... Wait, wait. Can I make fun of his fucking dead friend that he's suspected of killing? Um, Kyle, can I do that? If he's fucking gonna make fun of him, can I make fun? Yeah, I'm serious. Like, why not? Why not? You got a fucking dead friend. Your fu the girlfriend expects you having something to do with it. Somebody walked into your fucking uh, your place of business, put a bullet in your buddy's head. You're gonna make fun of Wings? Get the fuck out of here! Come on, man. You got no business making fun of anybody. FPS Russia. You had a, hey, you had a pretty good fucking run. Jesus Christ. You, you, you're, you're like one loose lip away of going to prison the rest of your life. <laughs> the freaking fun of this guy? That was crazy. Was I remember when that happened. That log. was nuts. God, I wouldn't be making fun of anybody. <laughs> yeah, it'll be a gulag. Didn't they find the guy dead in the gun store? God, yeah, somebody walked. So he, he opened the fucking door. So whoever he opened for, he thought he fucking somebody whacked him. Like for real. I snapped my finger. And I'll tell you something, Kyle, I've seen you interviewed over it. You don't seem mildly, mildly fucking, like, like, moved by it. Yeah, I, I don't know. Like, I don't have a problem with Medica goofing in this guy, but you? Holy shit. Things, things went south for you quick. Somebody said he tried to shoot wings, but the bullets are still in orbit. <laughs> <laughs> Let me wait this. The other day, and it was probably the darkest thing I'd ever seen in wings, uh, stream before. And he went and produced a photograph, a framed picture, and he was like, this is me when I weighed, I want to say, 240 pounds. And, and he shows the camera, and he's big, but he's 240 pounds, you know? Mm -hmm. And then he looks at that picture. This is me when I was like 14. I think I was like 240, 250 in that picture. What are you laughing at, Dioria? <laughs> <laughs> You're a little shubby wubby too. What is, what is with you? Uh, like, I'm not fat. Like, uh, yeah, I'm fat, but I play hockey. Is that it? <laughs> <laughs> Nick, do, I don't think I don't think Nick hates his life. <laughs> no, no, Nick does no, not no, hate no, his shit. life, and I know Nick has a pretty girl or had a pretty girlfriend or maybe a few. 
Nick, Nick's doing Dude, great. I know that. that. <laughs> it, you know that's that's the thing. Like you can be over. Like Nick, Nick fucking smiles at everything. He just laughs at everything. Laughs through life, and he works hard. You're doing good in school, right? Yep. I don't. Yeah, fucking head of. I, I have trouble believing that being a head of fraternity, but you're doing good in school, though. <laughs> Nick might. Nick might. Yeah, just, I'm doing pretty good. You're doing pretty good. Yeah, you're not like ace in anything, but you're getting it done. I'm getting some A's. Oh, really? See, see, the minute means yeah. Nick's smart. I now I hate Nick. Let me see. <laughs> and something happens. Something deep happened. He was just like, like a loss of hope. Like there was a moment where he was like, "That's where I was, and this is where I am." It I was a dark world. moment. What about we weren't well, 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 the same thing? You same thing can be said for you, Kyle. You were on top of the YouTube world. Then I shot my girlfriend, and it was a big problem. <laughs> his girlfriend, his business partner. Oh, he that shot his girlfriend. We were partner. like, oh. I mean, obviously, look, I think I can safely say you were mixed up with some bad dudes. I, I mean, or that I guy, what well, your business partner was. Somebody fucking murdered him. Oh, shit. The balls of this guy. Not real. Yeah, it was. It was a dark, dark moment. But then he started then he eating turns around. Uh, his banquet meal. It was a dark, dark moment. Like when you found no, out your friend was dead. turns around. It when you found out your friend was dead, was that a dark moment? Because I've seen the interview. You didn't see too fucking broken up over it. And 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 that perked us right back up. Because he 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 chews like a dog. You know, just to ch chomp, chomp, swallow, chomp, chomp, swallow, and that banquet meal's gone. It became a trend in the comment box that was like, "What, bro? Chew." We would count the chews. He would go chew, chew, swallow. And, and then when he was done with it, he starts scraping up all the gravy with the fork and, like, getting all the juices that, that were in the bottom of the plastic tray. And we're just like, this is not a diet. This no is, shit. This is He's not diet food. Um, those those, those <laughs> streams are fascinating to me. This was around the time that Wings was saying he was going on diet and losing all this weight. Oh, and okay. he didn't do it. Was this before or hey, after uh, that guy got killed? Hey, FPS Russia, what happened to your friend? What'd you do to him? Point and shoot like toilet. <laughs> what the fuck? Was that before or after? This is March 2000. I don't usually make videos. That was uh, after. That this was is after. when the FPS Russia was done. That was when he was done, and he's goofing on him. Yeah. I mean, look, goof on anybody you want, but Jesus Christ. Fuck. Like, and he didn't look like he was like, like that's not a diet. Yeah, no shit. He's lying to you. <laughs> People are saying that Kyle, FPS Kyle, wasn't near the stream or the scene. I get that, but Tommy's not saying that he killed him. He's saying it's I'm not saying he killed close. him. <laughs> I here's what I'm gonna say about Kyle. Here's what I've noticed when I said he showed he didn't seem terribly concerned, right? And it, it it's just the whole thing is unbelievably suspicious. And he had a turnaround, admittingly not as bad as Wings, but he was on top of this fucking platform, and it all went away because of stupid decisions. Like, like being investigated by the fucking FBI, having fucking illegal weapons, and then decided to send a whole bunch of weed over to your place? Or whatever the fuck he did? Not smart. My, my point is, my point is, I'm not saying Kyle killed him. I don't know. There's no evidence of it whatsoever. Right? All I'm saying is, uh, him and Wish, Wing shared something. You'd think he'd show a little bit of remorse. <laughs> I think yeah, it's weird. That, hey, goof on him all you want. I'm goofing on him. I don't give a fuck. But I just like, uh, you... That's a little weird. Am I wrong? I'm interested. I don't give a fuck. You guys tell me what. I Am I out of line here? I didn't say he killed him. No. I, I, I'm, oh, I'm saying he is just seeing Put a one in the chat if I'm. To put a one in the chat if you think I'm out of some two if I'm right. If I'm wrong, out, outright wrong. Because I didn't say he fucking killed him. I just like, holy shit. That's your friend? Breaking news people are fucking assholes. Hey, you figured you'd, you, you at quick. some level, I gotta be honest with you, I sympathize with him. At some level, I sympathize with him. You know? But look, he did fuck everything up, but I just, I don't know, I can't see... Who, who, who... Who, who... who I wouldn't do this to that fat fuck, um... I'm trying to think. I never did this to Cronin. Did I? After it was over, no. I was pretty much done. When somebody think I'm out on. You walked away. He's a tinfoil Can top. I yeah, I walked away. Like Wish him the best. And if he fucking swung at me, I'd swing back, but holy shit.
Hey, yeah. They're calling you tinfoil Tommy, but I mean, there's a tinfoil lot of Tommy. I never said online. anything. I said he showed. There's a lot of people online that think that Kyle killed the guy too. So I don't get. No, first of all, I don't think Kyle, I don't know that Kyle killed the guy. I do know this. Yeah. He showed zero, zero remorse, and he fucking lost his fame on YouTube, uh, his elite uh, on that elite like royalty status because of stupid decisions. Not unlike Wings of, Wings of Redemption. I find that bizarre. I wouldn't feel comfortable going on him under those circumstances. That's just me. There's no evidence think? whatsoever that he had anything to do with it. None. Zero. Zip. Let me make that clear. But I, yeah, a lot of people that believe it. Somebody walked in and fucking, and, and I think it's safe to say he was tied up with fucked up people. You know, usually when you're getting weird guns and shit, you might run into somebody that's not exactly, um, I don't know. Maybe some shady fuckers. Not Obviously, be on the up and up. Not everybody's on the up and up. And whoever walked in that place, that fucking guy knew him. Listen, you're not buying a fucking RPG from Dick Sporting Goods. Yeah, okay? <laughs> yeah exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I get um, RPGs in Georgia. Yeah, yeah this, is, this, you... is a, this is an ammunition on GTA. Yeah, Kyle lost <laughs> endorsement deals. Yeah, he did because he fucked it up. I'm, I'm, I'm saying like, yeah, it's a messy situation. I'm saying he fucked up. So did Wings. You know, PS what did, did Wings do something to him that I'm not aware of? You gave him a fucking chance to make some motherfucking dinero. That's what yeah, I guess so. About. All right, whatever. I said my Do you want to like, I sent you a link to 219 if you want to watch it. One where? The same place? Same down. place, yeah. Thanks so much, Shy. Oh, you could stay, Shy. <laughs> <laughs> you donated. <laughs> yeah, thanks for, thanks for sticking around. Here we go. <laughs> Everyone else get following me right now shooting at me. Oh, is that such a good team killer? <laughs> He's gonna break it. I just wanted to have a good fucking stream, dude. I, that's all I wanted to do. That's all anybody wants to do. Yeah, looks like you're at the point where that ship has sailed. <laughs> Good idea. Can you, can you, can you please stop, dude? Honestly, <laughs> can you stop, dude? <laughs> And that's just code for him no. doing it. Like, why again. are you doing this to and me? Again. Real, real talk. And why? Because you got a creep. There we go. <laughs> I would love to know the name of that subscriber. Does he? Have, oh, he has a fucking bike in the back. <laughs> I think it's Rochelle. Um, um, <laughs> big. Oh God. Oh God. Did you go to two nineteen? I thought that was Yavi. What's 219? Oh, maybe not. 219. When he fucking str he strangles the shit out of the controller. Oh, I see. <laughs> this is a recent one, I think. How did he miss? Oh, damn it, dude. No, oh, that I was his teammate. The, team <laughs> the guy jumping in front of him so oh, he couldn't hit sure his shot. And there's no team kills. <laughs> This is horrible. No. <sighs> no. <laughs> Jesus. You can just feel the volcano about to erupt. See, the thing is, like, you know why this is fucked up? You know why? Because he is trying to fucking pay his bills. And this guy don't give a fuck. Well, he actually has an answer for that a couple seconds. Yeah. Webby, fucking leave, dude! I don't think he's listening. <laughs> Cold smash! I... Wait for it, wait for it. He's 
All right, guys. If they join session again, I'm I'm just gonna have to fucking stop playing until they <laughs> until they leave. Like, all they're doing is hurting my livelihood. If somebody could please like get me their information, like maybe like um I forgot what that shit's called. Doxing. But doxing. <laughs> Like uh, if, if somebody could give me like their information, like their name, their address, the number, how I can get in contact with these guys, I would really like to know because like you know what you could do, you could send them over to Kyle. He'll take care of them. I'm seriously. <laughs> um, Tommy, you you so really we, think you could get something? What really? What you really think you could get something out of them? Me? Something positive? About yes. 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 I believe it. Really? You know, yes. Say that he was those people I absolutely, I, I absolutely, I, I absolutely uh, believe I can get something positive out of him. After all the people he's associated with over the years, I am just going to interview him once. I think I can make some, look. I think I can make an interesting interview without just fucking with him. Seriously, I I believe that. I did a whole interview with Scaris and I barely brought up his fucking memes, didn't I? Yeah. True. I, I think, think you could it. bring him on as almost a PSA for little kids to not want to become a YouTuber. <laughs> <laughs> this is what happens when it goes wrong. <laughs> Look, he did it. It's like one of the fucking when they bring in somebody to a high school to explain why you don't always want to attempt to be a professional athlete. It's somebody whose spine snapped at college. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. I know all you kids want to be quarterbacks, but look at me. <laughs> I got hit so hard, my brain went through my eyeballs. But they don't do that in hockey. Like, the guy in Boston University, he got the first shift. When I was I was in high school when this happened. You've seen that guy. You know exactly what I'm talking yeah. about. Too. Dude, first shift. I was in high school when that happened. Fucking went out, in the boards, in fucking, I think it was in Boston Garden, too. You know? Because they had that beanpot tournament. He went, literally went head with, that's it. Can't walk. Mm. He's about five or six years older than me. Still there, still alive too, from what I know. It's fucking crazy. Yeah, it's nuts. They never said that shit. They were like, you know, like Christopher Reeve and fucking, you know, go. Hockey didn't do that shit. Oh god, Christopher Reeve. Yeah, that's that why you don't like play half polo. Of, half of the Eminem songs from that era involved Christopher Reeve. Yeah, everybody like goofing on like Christopher Reeve until he died, and then everybody stopped goofing <laughs> on. Him. Yeah, a lot, a lot, a lot of. Uh, I remember I was listening, listening to the Exhibit record. I, I, I liked early Exhibit. It's mm -hmm. like, uh, one of the rhymes is, it's like, it's like Christopher Reeve doing the Crip Walk. And it was like, what the fuck? <laughs> wow. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it was like, no, Christopher Reeve was a, a frequent target of, of hip-hop uh, fo folks in, in the uh, industry. You yeah. think if Christopher Reeve was still alive, he would have gotten me too by now? I think he, there's still a chance. I got Robin Williams. Been Probably, dead for fucking like three or four years. Everybody's getting me too now. It's only a matter of time. There's always there's yep. always a chance. There's the horse that paralyzed him is gonna get me too next. <laughs> 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 Fuck, Riveter. I think I know what you want. What do you got? Some bad Jeremy, right? Hey, how you doing, Tommy? Yeah. Uh, let me give you. Let me give the audience. Um, you guys don't know. We, we talked about it a little bit on uh, last Thursday's show, but uh, Jeremy was at Gen Con. Which I didn't realize this. It's about board games. <laughs> yeah, board games and and uh, card, t you know, trading card games, things like that. Make a long story short, Jeremy was in a bar. He had people coming up to him. He had no problem with the whole show. He had people coming up to him all fucking day. And uh, the he um, he said that um, uh, this guy said, "Hey, are you Jeremy Such?" I said, "Yeah, I am." And he hit him in the head. Um, then he said he was going to leave. Then people encouraged him to leave or not to leave. He stuck around. Um, he reported it to the police, filed a police report, uh, collected some money. I guess he's going to sue the individual. He told the cops. The co the guy, the, the funny thing is the guy that hit him, allegedly, the guy that allegedly hit him, uh, Gen Con actually, like, really pushed his board game and he sold out, which is fucking, this shows you how much people hate Jeremy. Um, not me. And then, um, I guess he left yesterday. And uh, where are we at, Riveter? You have some kind of issue with Jeremy. Yeah, I, I don't have as much uh, an issue with, with Jeremy. I mean, I used to watch his videos and, and uh, what have you. Um, mm. But, you know, after whatever happened with Wizards and all that, you know, he really kind of went down a path where he's real negative, right? Mm -hmm. And so I kind of quit watching. But um, the problem I have is, is, I guess about a month or so ago, there was another uh, big player in the uh, – uh, magic area called uh, his name is uh, Wedge, and yeah. he had a uh, uh, medical issue arise when he was at the GP in Vegas, and so somebody created a GoFundMe to help mm -hmm. pay for his medical bills, which is cool and all that. Right? That's cool. 
but but uh, Jimmy kind of went in pretty hard on him because he, he felt like um, you know Wedge should have been saving all this money that he was making from YouTube and his YouTube videos to help incur that cost. Which yeah, okay, whatever, right? Yeah. yeah. Um, that seems a little. It, it does seem a little hypocritical, though. I suppose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and the thing of it is, is here's the thing, right? Like, I don't have a problem because somebody created this this uh, GoFundMe account for Jeremy to help incur uh, any legal costs he wants to go after this guy civilly because he assaulted him, right? Yeah, I guess because no one's going to arrest yeah. a fucking guy, apparently. <laughs> you know, yeah, right? Yeah. yeah, just another one of these uh, yeah. unprosecutable assaults, whatever, yeah. right? So, and I don't have a problem with that either. I don't have a problem with who you have a problem TV with the, uh, the, you know, one guy trying to get some money for some hospital bills and another guy. And, you know, he's he's been awful critical yeah. of, um, I don't know. I don't know what to argue with you. I'd have to see it to be, I'd have to see yeah. it to be uh, 100% sure. Well, maybe, maybe, maybe he's being a little hypocritical or maybe he has a new view on it. Maybe, maybe he's wrong, you know, back then. Well, maybe, uh, I doubt it. I mean, like I said, you know, I, I like Jeremy. I think he's okay. And, yeah. and I I guess Wedge is okay too. I don't really uh, follow either one of them uh, because I just try to stay out of that whole negative thing. I'm not really normally a negative person, but. Mm -hmm. You and I'm not me? like a you one of these me? commentator guys. <laughs> you like guys like the Oreo, I love you, I guess. though. Mr. Positive. No, no, no. I love you, Tommy. I, uh, I, I, honestly, I didn't even know the Oreo until he came on your show. But uh, yeah, but I don't know, man. I just it you just know, seemed hypocritical. Uh, you know, well, I'm actually a pretty big deal. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> people, I tell you what. I tell you what. I might get him on. Uh, maybe I'll ask him a question. But I'm not going to ask you rudely or anything. Yeah. I'm just going to say, hey, what do you yeah. think of this? I got to be honest. I disagree with Jeremy on a lot of things. Um, I think his whole not 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 the way he spoke to her. He called those cosplay girls grifters, and he suggested they were taking advantage of young boys that are kind of socially awkward. Which I told him right to his face was I thought it was bullshit. I think it's ridiculous. You're fucking going to these Gen Cons and Wizard Cons and shit like that. I like to see a little trim when I'm fucking with my fucking <laughs> neck beard friends around. What? You know who cares? You know, uh, but but Tommy, they really don't like you. They're pretending. So what? So do hookers. You know, it's kind of funny. The only girls yeah. that go are paid to be there. Yeah, exactly. Well, I, I think I accept <laughs> that. Yeah. We, we, know, we, I, I, I actually have a, a theory kind of on that, Tommy. Yeah. You know, uh, I'm not with you, right? I mean, I've been to these GPs and I played in them and competed and what have you. And let me just be honest with you, okay? Most of those guys are, are, are they smell bad. So <laughs> it's nice to get around some really cute girls, right? It's I'm not so surprised. I'm not surprised. <laughs> Yeah, who cares so, if know, some broad comes in there and tells him, "Hey, you're really good at this game." I am. Fuck, <laughs> give nah, some of your Patreon. Played a fucking TCG. If anybody plays a fucking TCG, yeah. wash your ass if you're going to a fucking public place. It's <laughs> right thing. These you motherfuckers smell like stuff. a ball of sweat. Fucked a dead animal. It's terrible. Oh, I, I thought you were doing pulling a turkey. You have a place like that in the mall that yeah. have little okay. weekend things. What are you saying? What are you saying, though, Reverend? Okay, so yeah. my theory is, is this right? Is I don't know specifically it was the the girl that he made these negative content or comments towards, uh -huh. but I think it was like one of those girls he had a thing for, maybe even they had a little thing or something. She dumped him. I think he's kind of bitter about it, man. I no, I I, 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 I don't know. If there's anything like that. The thing is, maybe he is, maybe he isn't. But here's the thing: at the fucking end of the day, he has every right to criticize them on an off platform, and it shouldn't be like they literally disagree. Like I disagree with Jeremy. I don't think he should be. They take his fucking cards away. Like they they. They took his cards away. The money that he gave Wizards of the Coast and Mattel, they took it away. They stole from him. And then, well, admittingly, it was out of revenge. He found legitimate problems with pedophiles. Not, not accusations, like guys that were on the list that, 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 that turned themselves in. And Wizards of the Coast thought it was worse that he said rotten things about chicks. Whether he broke up with a girl or didn't or he's not doing it for the right reasons, I think that's all red herring. It's whether well, I, he's right or he's wrong. And I think he's right to point out if there's pedophiles coaching, you know, 15, 16 year old kids. I'd want to know if I was sending my kid to there. I know Wizards of the Coast and Mattel doesn't know. I don't think he should be assaulted or punched in the fucking face and the cops and the fucking bar and Gen Con who, God forbid, if some broad broke their fucking fingernail, they'd be looking for a safe place and firing everybody, uh, getting rid of anybody that hadn't even stood next to Jeremy at one fucking point. You know, I, 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 I mean, whatever his reasons are, and if you don't want to watch him because he's negative, and he's negative, but I, I got to be honest with you. The way he's being treated is just unbelievable. It's just a complete double standard. And like, like Verse says, he knows it's bullshit, but it's just Jeremy's a jerk off. 
but it's still wrong, yeah. you know? I mean, it's still fucking wrong. I, and, and personally, I've talked to Jeremy privately. I really like him. I, I didn't do shit to me, but disagree with me. I, mean, well, I have nothing bad to say about the guy, but then it's like the Keemstar complex. Yeah, they fucked him, but did he deserve it? Did he? I don't know if he deserved it. I don't think he did. I, 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 I'm not seeing it. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, with Keem, it's a little different because, you know, he was doing shady fuck. I know, I know what went on at that little ho helicopter flight. And, uh, you know, yeah, and, and it's like, that was sort of a, I don't know, some kind of justice move, like a street justice move by Graydon Leafy. Yeah, he probably did deserve it. But I don't know if this guy falls in that category. I don't know if having a difference in political opinions falls in that category. I'll come on if you pay me in burgers. Deal. <laughs> well, here, here's the thing. I want to update you a little bit too, Tommy. Uh, yeah. it, did he deserve what he got? No. Does no. he have the right to say what he say 100%? Did he deserve to get punched? No. But I will say this. He did recoup his money because Wizards did, in fact, refund uh, like they gave him money. money they, so, yeah, he got that. They back, gave the money so. back. I didn't know that. Okay, then, then, then. Okay, yeah, yeah. They, they, then. Okay, they we shouldn't have took it in the first place. They shouldn't have took it the first. Place. Well, you know, the, the thing of it is, is this is is you know he had a right to say what he said. Well, he doesn't have a right to go uh, without to the, a doubt. Yeah, he doesn't have a right to go. He to doesn't. Have, yeah, he no, he, he doesn't have. To, he, you know, he didn't deserve necessarily getting banned. But here's the thing, right? We're talking about a private <laughs> company, right? So they yeah. can do what the hell they want to do, right? Yeah, yeah, no, I got you. Gotcha. But I mean, I, I'm finding it a little spooky that companies are ba banning me. From Why don't you take a little bit out of Wings Book? It's bad for your brand. You shouldn't do that. And I did an interview. And subscribers. I did an interview, and this came up with Billy the Fridge on Tommy C's Arcade. Link in the description below. It's the last stream we did. It's like two hours, right? And it's a different type. It's not like a shot from the point in, uh, interview. Uh, and he brings this up, and and that's what Billy says. It's because he doesn't have a bad thing to say about Jeremy. It's just his. It, they don't want. Um, what Jeremy brings to the table, they don't want it, and they're willing to sacrifice the money, even if it hurts them, uh, money-wise. Uh, they're willing to get rid of it because they'd rather not have Jeremy around. They want a bunch of social justice clowns around, according to um, Billy the Fridge, who, by the way, is apparently was really into Magic at one point and a regular Stop player. Thanks yeah. so much, Smoke the Bear. Best show on YouTube. Keem, uh, on YouTube, Keem Star is irrelevant. I don't know about that. Is that but, zero related to Patrick Star? <laughs> I don't know, man. Did, anything else you want to say before we get out of here? Because I gotta, I'm gonna run the donations and call it a day. No, nah, but keep up good job. I love your show, man. I, I love you too, man. And you know what? Because you've been around a long, long time, you are getting known, fuckhead. So have a good one. Thanks, brother. All right, man. Go post memes. Um, your life is now complete. Your life is complete. Goodbye. <laughs> right, bye. bye. Yeah, I don't know. I, I like. I, I just you people. I'll put this guy. Hey, real quick, man. What's up? Oh, hey, Tommy. I was just wondering. Um. All these YouTubers, like, falling from grace. What do you think, like, uh, you know, this uh, Wings of, of Redemption and, uh, like, Boogie, all these guys, these big guys that were, like, really big in, like, 2010, 2012. Yeah. Like, because I just try to understand what happened. I'll, I'll tell you what it is. I'll tell you what it is. It's normal. People going to get popular and unpopular. People going to peak. I peaked already. <laughs> I, just deal, I just deal with it. Well, the only thing that keeps me fucking going is because I shaped my thing off of radio and radio has more longevity that's what i believe my format's radio so it's more got, it's got more longevity i can spit out mm -hmm. more content quicker easier yeah. um as far as well i mean i don't know I, I mean look at it like this uh walking dead was really big five years ago it's not yeah, as big yeah. anymore it's just that I simple a fan of that. it's just that simple and, and, and the thing is your your entire mostly with youtubers it's not necessarily based on your content it's based on your personality you know i was watching this douchebag today the, the guy that M McCrudden's boss, or the guy who got him started, he has absolutely no discernible talent. He can't host. He can, he can be, he, there's nothing exciting about him. He's careful with every word he picks. Uh, he's not yeah. funny. Th th he has no talent, but he knows how to work the algorithm. And so, mm -hmm. and, and, and that's what, and he's got fucking 3.4, 9 million subs. And look you know? at guys like um, PewDiePie or something. Yeah. Even if you're at the top of the platform, you could still fuck up. You still fuck up. But when up. you're guys yeah. like Wings of Redemption, when you're a fucking one trick pony and you do one thing, can't mm -hmm. afford it. Yeah. It could fuck up behind the scenes and fuck you out of your job. Yeah. There's so many different variables so, that go yeah, into becoming a things, content like, creator. Like, Some know, are out of your control. One of the things but, is being found out to be a snake because everything's personality based. The team's always trying to put in everybody, whether you're Tim Foyle, Tommy, or you're a snake, you're a snake, you're a snake, you're a snake. Because if the fans find out you're a snake, They've lost that in, in personal. That that's the thing that keeps them that personal um, 
uh, a connection that you have. Why do you think that FaZe Banks writes little old me on the regular? Because he knows that I'm potentially going to cut that cord, that, that personal relationship, that connection that he's made with generations of kids now. But if they find out that he tells multiple different fucking stories on the same thing, um, then that means he might not be trustworthy. He knows that. That's why he does, that, that, like. Yeah. That's why he comes out and he says the only reason you're doing this is X, Y, and Z. That's what it, that's what this is all about. So why people they they come and go? And here's the thing: YouTube's not like fucking TV. Look, if married with children, you know, uh, the, the Simpsons didn't make a video on on married with children. Yeah. Are you guys goofing on me now? Do you are you where are you first? Real Rex. <laughs> please please respond. You know, so, so it's like, just a matter of thing, and it, you can't you can you can actually attack another person's channel and actually take their subs. It, it's it's yeah. a weird thing. It's a new thing. So that's what happened to him. Um, but like, there's also like these fuck ups because I'd say like like this big YouTube channel tend to have more like bigger fuck ups. I mean, yeah, I suppose I, people I don't fuck know. up. People yeah. fuck up. You know, people screw up. I mean, it's like the only difference is like. You have a YouTube channel and a fan base. I don't see anybody really uh, like, like Daddy O Five would be an exception. Um, yeah, uh, Pootie Pie. Ooh, really, really. F oh, the guy who shot his the girl who shot his fucking boyfriend. That's a big fuck up. Um, yeah, but yeah, just think, a little bit. No, about, no. I swear to God, you shoot that Desert Eagle through the phone book, it's not going <laughs> to kill me. Get it on the Google. Yeah. Like, well, 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 let's look at how. We, all right, Le Leafy was a bit of a snake. Um, Grade was arrogant. Yeah. Um, all right. Uh, who else has fucking lost? Lost. Uh, uh um, I Boogie, think Boogie, Boogie sat in the fence. Stuff. Boogie sat in the fence a lot. He never. He, he kind of sat in the fence, and he's but, also lost his fucking mind. Yeah, he's lost but his Boogie mind. Always, <laughs> but are, are, are Boogie these, always. Are these? Are, they, are those things I just said? Are they major fuck ups? Or are they just like everyday personality flaws? The only way you can avoid fuck ups is to be colossal as crazy. If you don't upload, you can't fuck <laughs> up. <laughs> <anything>. Come on. <laughs> You know, they're not. They're not serious fuck ups. Or if you do fuck up, do what Doctor Disrespect did. They're serious. Yeah, <laughs> but not everybody gets. That's to not even that serious a fuck up. If you look how many people cheat in their wives, if you really think about it, I'm not saying it. I'm sure I'm going to piss off every girl in the, in the audience, but in, in the grand scheme of things, it's not even that big a fuck up. His um, fuck up wasn't the cheating; it was breaking his character and crying on stream. Yeah, it was. That was it, yeah, was, so in the grand scheme of things, like you talk about big, none of these are big fuck ups. This is just kids growing up. <laughs> that's, that's, that's what you're I mean, singing. You know, you're seeing it live on t TV. You know, it's been a lot. It's been a long time since someone's been on blog TV with their fucking hands up and not starting themselves. Yeah, <laughs> they're big. They're big fuck ups in the bane of YouTube. But it's just like when you make your living, if everything's like everything's reality show based on YouTube. You know, that's where everybody learned yeah. how to become a YouTuber. They watch reality shows, and in that vein, yeah, it's a big fuck up. But because because it's it's like this. Like, why was Michael Jackson able to fucking get away with raping kids? Because he didn't give a fuck who he was, he cared about his music. There's no look at R. Kelly with a YouTuber. Yeah, R. Kelly pissing on chicks. He outright says it. Yo, when someone does that, I've been married to R. Kelly since I was 12 years old. Yeah. Good. Yeah, exactly. Good exactly. But there's a separation with YouTube. It's you. It's yeah. YouTube. It's 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 the individual. So like, little the, the normal things, all pissing on girls and fucking kids is normal. Um. It's connected directly to your content, and that's why you're going to lose every time. I mean, if Joey Salads can pee in his mouth and not get in trouble, I think anyone can pretty much do anything. <laughs> I suppose. But, I mean, <laughs> at least that was funny. You know, and here's another thing about you. It's a dirty secret of Joey Salads. All right. Um, yeah. You know, I, I although I like, I'll make this clear, I like Ethan. He was nothing but mm -hmm. nice to me. Uh, and I think things have changed. The, the guy I hear the most complaints about behind the scenes... Is H3H3. Hands down. Yeah. You know who the guy who I hear mostly the most positive things is Joey Salads. <laughs> <laughs> he's a fucking great guy. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, Joey Salads is a great guy. I won't say it publicly uh, because uh, like, 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 Joey, he's a fucking nice, uh, easy going guy. He's just the guy. Uh, yeah, he's real cool. He, yeah, he bought me lunch, you know. <laughs> he really? He Today's like, a so Trump card prank. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like everybody likes Joey Salas. Nobody likes H H H three H three. Yeah, um, I'm not included in that. I just want to make that abundantly clear. I I like Ethan, and I think mm -hmm. some of the some of the shit he has acknowledged, like saying, you know, I was kind of an asshole for a few years. I like his podcast. 
And mm-hmm. uh, but I, I think that's it's just weird. You don't know who these people are, even if they're playing a character in sec- in section extension, and then they're. You know their 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 personality is directly kind, tied in their content. If that personality can be sort of roped into being a snake, then you're mm-hmm. fucked. Unless you are famous for being a snake, Keemstar. Yeah, yeah, that's the way mm-hmm. I think. All right, talk to you later, bud. All right, but well, before I go, can we get some likes up in the chat? Like, yeah, 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 good thing. yeah come on. Thanks, Michael. <laughs> Appreciate it. And if you don't donate, get the fuck out. Yeah, you donate, get the fuck out. Nice show today, guys. I had fun. Um, I am definitely doing a shot from the point extra no matter what it's happening tomorrow on the other channel link is in the description below There will be a shot from the point extra tomorrow. There will not be one Wednesday Because uh, I, I got I, I it's, it's my wife's birthday. We're going out for her birthday. It's not a birthday, but it's the day we're going out for. So um, we'll do it. We'll do four shows this week Faux show which we've been doing pretty um, Consistently, let me shout out um, the very very generous donators here um, who people been, who don't get banned pe- from the chat. people people who aren't yeah people aren't that don't want to get banned chat only stream I like that I would never do that uh, well maybe I would I shouldn't say that Scrubby um, we, uh, Jay and Silent Bob YouTube Ricochet the man the myth the legend uh, Kill, uh, Kofalski crazy old man from Oz thanks so much um, a long time fuckhead crazy old man from Oz uh, uh, PC Remy, our relationship is going to change dramatically. I'll see you tomorrow, Syndicate Wings. <laughs> <laughs> I would love to ask him about that. Um, uh, he was 20 bucks from IVX. Wings into fitness. Fit no cheeseburgers in mouth. Uh, There's 15 things you can't ask me about. One of them, Syndicate. The other is my weight. The other one's my raging. <laughs> what can we talk about? <laughs> I guess we'll have to do some other time. <laughs> <laughs> That would be what is mine. your weekly controller budget? Yeah. <laughs> Shy, S H A I I. If I'm saying that correctly, Smoky bitch. Bear, Alex Tiskeski. Um, did you hear about Ted Xing? Yes, I did. Boy, do people want me to cover that or what? This fucking thing that went on at TED Talk. This shit went on right here in Germany. I didn't know about it. I yelled at Joe for that. You know that? I go. I, go, Joe, I do. I did. I said, "Do you read German papers?" No. Start. Okay. That shit's fucking crazy. Yeah. No, it's not my crazy. Milo Yiannopoulos warned us. He said it was coming. <laughs> he was right. Why do you think I get so mad at Digi, bro? That he likes to look at eight-year-olds being drawn and fucked? Because it normalizes pedophilia. The LGBTQP, my dudes. Yeah. <laughs> no, not all of them. I'm not going to go that far. I don't know all of them. But, no, uh, no, but the P. But I think there is an aspect of that community that is okay putting the P in there somewhere. And I want to know who the fuck they are. I don't know if I'm going to cover that or not. I don't think that's a funny for shot from the point. Um, I feel like yeah, that's, 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 not a, that's not a lighthearted topic. Yeah, and there's a half a dozen guys who I don't know who the fuck they are because they wrote Wings and Dengshin. Thanks so much for the uh, for, for, the, for, 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 for the donations in the chat. We'll see you tomorrow on the other channel. Link in the description box below. Uh, we're also at Tommy C's Arcade. You can check us there. We also got t-shirts, all that other good shit. Thanks so much. Uh, have a good one. Uh, all the best to Real Talk, the Metaphor Messiah. Make sure you check out his video. Link is also in the description box below. He's still kicking it. He's still getting his work done. Look back. Tell Wings I want to. Come on. This is the almighty infinite, independent excellence. Devil fighting, rebel titan, we smoking alchemists. Fake identities, okay, you cool with Jason Bourne. Running with these Wolverines, okay, you about to catch a storm. I ain't never been a liar, got tired of niggas playing me. Head in my legs like she about to catch a pedigree. Shy town the King's home, slapping fives, black stones. Six mile to danger zones, bullets look like waffle cones. So affiliated to evolution. The Machiavelli Don't th- th- make me lead the Migos to you like I'm Chip Kelly They feel my struggle, I express it through my hip-hop I'm about to make it hard to breathe Some guy in the chat wrote, Jews control Keem <laughs> <laughs>